Hey everyone, this is Sunglass Rob from SportRx. And Prescription Goggle, Tyler from SportRx. I like that I get to say that again because, because... It's gonna be snowboard time soon and snow, ski time snow. soon. We're so excited. So... It's my favorite time. Uh, it's, it's very exciting. The, the winter is coming and we're going to uh, get out on the mountain. And you might be wondering, what is the difference between the Smith IO and the Smith IO X and the Smith IO 7? And after you're done watching this video, Wonder no more! Okay, so really, it probably comes down to fit mostly. Yeah. Um, the IO is the original from the IO series, and that's this guy right here. Then they came out with a bigger one called the IOX, and the X stands for like extra large. It's bigger. It's basically the extra. same exact thing, but bigger. IO, but extra. And then they came out IO. with the IO7, which is the newest one. I would say it has a couple of features that I like better, and fit wise, it's kind of the IO. It's kind of right in the middle. I would say maybe a, little, maybe a little larger than the IO. Yeah, it's a little larger than the IO, a little smaller than the IOX. We'll both try them on for you guys because. We have different size heads, and it'll probably give you a good understanding of the fit. So um, why don't we just start trying them on, and then sure. we'll go over kind of features and differences and similarities and, and break IO. it all down for you. So that's the IO, and that's on Tyler, who Tyler, um, I would say, is about a medium fit, maybe edging closer to small to medium than truly a medium fit. I like to think um, that I'm pretty regular. You're a regular guy. Plain old, regular. Plain old regular Tyler. And um, I would say I'm a large to extra large fit, maybe even closer to extra large than large. So kind of more regular average size and then bigger, bigger head over here. So those fit you pretty well. And they feel good. They feel good. You yeah. know what feels really nice? What? The triple layer foam. The triple layer foam is amazing on them. You know what feels really nice for me is oh, that um, in my IOs, I have the IOX at home. I have a prescription insert in them. Tell them about that. You can do these in prescription. I knew that. So, that's what these guys are. We have different shapes, different sizes, because we have found that we're the best at figuring out what's gonna fit them best in your prescription and the goggles. We have just such a close relationship with both. And so we can put your prescription in it. The insert system works extremely well. I have a really weird prescription and I questioned whether it was gonna work for me and it works amazingly works well. So in any IO, you can get it with a prescription insert from SportRx, that's the, the side message of the video. But back to the IO, uh, the IO fits me very well. The IO fits you well. Maybe small, sorry, yeah. the IO doesn't fit me well. I, I think it does, I think it does though, because uh, the thing that I, I feel comfortable with with dealing with people over the phone is that they are, they're very forgiving in fit. Goggles are in general. Yeah, because I mean, I'm not looking at that and thinking, dude, those are tiny on you. Okay, let's well, move on. Well, that's comfort, I guess. All right. So let's fine. let's skip let's skip the IO X because let's go size size wise. I say the IO seven is going to be the in between size, and that's also the newest one. This fits me. I think really well, cool. and I think it also fits you. Uh, I like that one a lot. So that's well. the IO seven. Uh, this is my favorite. All right, give them to Pretty me. Short. I love that color it? too. I don't want to give them up. I just want to keep wearing. Come All right, on. fine. <coughs> so here is the IO seven on a bigger head, and it looks good. I know I said these look good before on you, but those definitely look good. But How do they feel on your nose? Fine, and I have a big, weird, twice broken nose. Do you feel? <laughs> we'll talk about that sometime. Yeah. You don't feel like it's closing your nostrils at all? Because that's the thing I noticed about it that's really nice. My, my nose Very felt good and Very open. Okay, so then the biggest one is the IOX. And I would think the IOX is probably almost gonna be too big yeah. on you. However, there's definitely a theme of goggles being very big. And if you're looking for a very oversized goggle, again, because of the adjustability, it's gonna be forgiving and it's probably gonna fit well. But let me see. Yeah, they're a little. They're yeah, a little I mean, much. outside, I guess, also outside of them feeling or looking maybe a little oversized, they don't feel like they they close on my face as well as. The and this I one just feels sure. right on me. Yeah, it's the right. X. I'm an extra large. It's yeah. just this yeah, the right one. Right. Okay, so there you go for fit wise. Let's talk about a little bit about the goggles. So some things in common with all the IOs is that they can take prescription. 
and they also all automatically come with a second set of lenses. So what's gonna happen usually is you're gonna have a darker lens or an everyday lens for brighter conditions. And then you're gonna have a low light lens for overcast days and bad weather. And the whole idea with the IO is that you can easily interchange the lenses. So for example, this one's coming with a uh, Chroma Pop Storm, and then it comes with a Chroma Pop I believe every day. every day. So this is going to be kind of for regular cloudy-ish to sunny conditions. And this is like for stormy, white out, bad weather conditions. Very cool that you automatically get both lenses with the goggles. Speaking of lenses, um, on the IO series, they're all going to be spherical lenses, not cylindrical. Spherical lenses are basically cut from two, like they're, they're from like a basketball. They angle both, both ways. Football as opposed to like a sphere, a cylindrical lens, which is only based Flat on this. Yes. and curved. Yeah, this, this one is, is curved, curved. and curved. <laughs> and the curved and curved way uh, gives you better optics, a little bit sharper optics, and also a little bit better fogging, only because that little bit more- Fog resistance. Wrap, yeah, better, better fog resistance. Thank you. Um, because there's a little bit more volume inside the goggle. Speaking of fogging, all of these have Smith's amazing uh, anti-fog coating on the inside, which you don't wanna play with as much as you can. So if they get dirty on the inside, by all means wipe them down, but don't excessively clean the inside of your and never, goggle. And never do it wet. Yeah, don't do it wet, wet's Ever. bad. Okay, so um, mm -hmm. some more similarities. They're all dual pane lenses, um, double lenses, which is also great for anti-fog measurement. And there's one feature that they all have that I really, really like, and that's this Pore-X filter. And it just looks like a little dot, and you're like, ah, that means nothing. But it's actually a really cool concept. What happens is with elevation change, pressure changes as well. And this is basically like a pressure release valve. It lets um, the, the uh, let's the air in and out. Yes. I got pressure. caught up there for a second. I don't know why you did. Yeah, Just think of a bag of chips. Yes. When you go up into the mountains, it just blows bottom. up. Well, what if that happened with your lenses? The lens will flex. You may not even notice it when you're looking at the lens, but it's going to affect your optic. Yeah, and the Smith thought about that and did that so that the Pretty pressure cool. goes out so that it doesn't warp the lens so that the optics are as clear at the bottom of the mountain or at the top of the mountain, which is pretty genius. I love that. Yeah. Um, they all also have triple foam, super comfortable. The last layer is antimicrobial, very, 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 very soft. Um, condensing foam goes to your face. Super comfortable all day goggle. I've worn these in some crazy conditions before and they're, they work great. Um, I think the difference is gonna be though on the interchangeability. So the IO and the IOX have this, um, I guess now traditional system where this locks open. It's yeah. kind of basically the same system. Yeah. The IO7, since it's newer, um, has more of this open ratchet unlock system. We also have how to interchange all these lens videos out there for check you uh, on YouTube, so you can check those out. Um, the IO7, it was not the seventh version of the IO. What happened is on the seventh anniversary of the original IO, they came out with the IO7. So that's where the name comes from. Uh, Lots of cool colorways. Man, there's so many details on all of these. They all have the great adjustable strap that kind of clips in like that. They all have that this amazing silicone, silicone and that keeps it from sliding around on your helmet. Nice. Uh, chroma pop lenses, they all come with chroma pop lenses now. That's it, what you want. Yeah, don't get not chroma pop. If you're finding non chroma pop Smith goggles, just stop. Get the chroma pop. It's unbelievable. We're right? not saying don't not get chroma pop. We're saying don't get not chroma pop. Get Chroma Pop. Uh, it gives you much better contrast, enhances everything. The vision atom is amazing. There's a lot of new technology coming out on goggle lenses and, and it really makes a big, big difference. Um, what else? I, I, you pretty well covered it. That was everything about the that's, IOs. That's like everything. Okay, so if you want to get a pair, you can get them from sportrx.com. Comment if you have experience with these, if you know what you like and how great they are. Yeah. And if you have them already and you don't have the Chroma Pop lenses, you can call us and we'll send you just lenses for your goggle. That's another cool thing. You yeah, can we do. can do that too. You can just get new yeah. lenses. Or if you already have a goggle and you just want the prescription insert, we, we can, can do that, that too. too. Um, what can't we do? There's not that's that, a short list. That's not a, yeah, we do a lot. We're, and we're good we're at cool. it and we're happy and we're fun. We weren't mic'd up at C, you're allowed to smack them. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. I'm really glad we're mic'd up. Stop jazzing them. Comes around. Razzing. I'm the one kind no, of video. No, so you're not razzing them. You're jazzing them.